So Richard, um, some of your thoughts on the match? Yeah, we were wrapped with obviously the outcome. We after we played last Saturday night, we all had a really good feeling. We were looking forward to coming over and getting on the biggest spaces at Bell Reeve. The boys like to play over here. Our, our leg speed comes into our vogue a fair bit over here. So we were confident going into the game. We just needed to apply it for four quarters and we knew we'd be in the game. Obviously, we just fell over the line in the end, but we've got the four points, so we're really happy. And how important is the victory on one set around? Yeah, I mean, we, we can't look too far ahead. Like, we've, we've got to get ourselves back square at the legend next week playing Launceston so we just need to keep winning and obviously we've done that today so now our focus is on next week so we'll worry about finals if we get there later in the year but it, it's just nice to get a, a great win for the group over here. And are your third quarters a bit of a concern? You only kicked one goal in the third quarter. Yeah but I think uh, Clarence obviously at half time came out with a different mindset and they applied themselves a lot better than what we did so I think if we were to say our third quarter is a concern, it's more so Clarence is a good player starting in the footy a lot more so we just were able to hold it up enough that obviously in the end we, we won by a point so we, we can still improve but I think it's more credit for Clarence for getting themselves back in the game. And, and how did you feel uh, young Henry Johnston getting the ruck after him? Yeah I think he, he think, uh, I think he worked his way into it probably a little bit early, he was a little bit off the pace, he, he's played in the Mercury Cup for now five weeks, so just it's just an opportunity for him. And I think as the game went on, he got better. So he just needs to continually to improve, and he can be more consistent over four quarters. And so you got Launceston at home next week. They had a pretty good victory this afternoon. Yeah, I just I had a look before. Sonny Whiting's back in form with six, so he's someone I identify as being a good player. Um, obviously, they're well coached and. Sam's a quality player, so around the ball, around stoppages, we're going to have to work hard that our midfield are accountable. Um, so it's a big challenge, but something, a game we're looking forward to.